Apple is scrambling to make their shareholders happy. Let me explain. With a market cap of $2.66 trillion, Apple is huge. They're the biggest company. Therefore, there is an expectation of we have to meet quotas, we have to meet expectations that our shareholders have for us, and therefore, we are struggling. Apple is at the point in their technology where they're just too good. Here in front of me, I have a M1 MacBook Pro that was purchased whenever the M1 was released. And it works just as well as the M1 Ultra and the M2 and probably the M3. Because at a certain point, once you get to a certain level, changes or upgrades are so incremental that they're not noticeable. Therefore, the M1 was such a big change from the i7 lineup that the M2 and the M3 was really nothing special for the average user. Even the editors or software developers, they're perfectly fine with the M1 lineup. And that's where Apple is struggling. They're releasing these M2, M3, probably M4 next year chips when everybody just needs an M1 and they don't know what else to do. They release iPhones with 47 cameras on them, when in reality, one lens is probably fine or two or three is perfectly fine. Why make seven lenses for the average person? And of course, they have their pro lineup and their regular lineup, but they want you to buy the pro lineup. Let's be honest. So how are they scrambling? A few minutes ago or about an hour ago, I finished watching the keynote for October 2023. And what did they announce? The M3, the chip, the Ultra, the Pro, and the regular M3, a new MacBook Pro, which is exactly like any other MacBook Pro, except now it comes in black, and an iMac. That is a decent upgrade. I think that's long overdue. But anyway, there are three items that nobody really needed, and they're only released because their shareholder meeting is in three days and they need to tell the shareholders something on how they are you know, advancing, how they are state of the art, one of a kind, whatever other buzzwords they use. When in reality, they're, they're just scrambling. They don't know what to do. And hopefully this works. They're just throwing stuff at the wall. If you agree with me, let me know if you have anything to add. If you disagree with me, please let me know because I'm not a financial analyst. I'm just some guy that makes videos in his office. So if I'm wrong, I'm wrong. I want you to tell me why. You guys have a great day. Bye.